let's start off with goal number one so mappers as you may know i've been building mappers every single day for over 200 days now and my goal is to have the biggest collection of map arts in minecraft bigger than uh, 2b2t's players map art collection 2b2t players are limited to uh, like 64,000 maps for now but i don't have that limit on me so yes i want to make more map arts than 32,000 and oh actually i have found out that could be a really nice way to like do updates on that situation because i have an interesting map art project in mind problem with it of course is that it's absolutely stupidly big i don't think it's quite reaching billions of blocks but it is it is big uh, actually what was it give me calculator again so we have 16 times 9 times 128 oh actually i can't even calculate this with my calculator here because the project is too massive yeah the project exceeds 1 billion blocks and i have came up with a way of uh, making updates on this project do you want a reveal of the project the reason why i'm confident in my ability to complete a 1 billion block map art is that it's because it's going to be a manga map art. yeah manga map art. and the way i could do updates on this is by just doing a video about every single panel that i build okay manga map art what am i talking about so my first goal was like oh maybe i should make a like find the most uh, enjoyed uh, most adored uh, manga chapter of all time like a chapter that everyone adores everyone enjoyed it so much everyone loves this chapter of certain manga whatever or it's just made history like i don't know chapter 1000 of one piece that was a pretty big thing so i could make something like that but then i got the idea what is my favorite fight all of manga and it turns out it's Aki versus Yujiro. so i was like hmm what would it take for me to build entire baki versus Yujiro? Five. let's say baki versus yujiro takes 20 chapters those 20 chapters have 20 pages and all those pages are 16 by 9 map art so you have 2.4 million blocks per page where you have 400 pages what comes down to 1 billion blocks yeah and manga is black and white so it limits materials a lot fortunately to like easily obtainable for me white wool black stained glass e grindstone easy brewing stands easy dyed gray and gray easy okay so everything is quite easy to obtain here and diorite diorite is a little bit harder to obtain than at the other blocks but it's still somewhat easy also stone cobblestone that that's easy these are basically all the dark blocks oh there's also like uh, quota, but it's doable so 1 billion block mapper how far is that project going yeah with updates on it it would have like 400 times let's say there are six panels per page you have uh, 2400 update video 2400 on it considering that i could be uploading a uh, update video like every week update video on that then you have 2400 weeks divided by 51 equals just over 47 years of making 1 billion block map art sounds feasible to me these are the sorts of goal I, goals i have where mathematically we go and it's 47 years to make this sort of map art. this is one of five goals and on top of that i would be still continuing my map art everyday series with all those maps all those flags all those fictional characters yeah, map art every day is going to become like virtually pretty much only 2d one by one map art because there's simply not enough time in a day for me to make a bigger map art or 3d map art and also continue my goals of the biggest map art collection or making this sort of map art happen you see it's kind of ridiculous when you go and mathematically try to analyze these goals because then you get 47 years in the making for that to happen 47 years i don't know if anyone is going to remember even Bucky in 47 years yeah so that divided by 20 because there are 20 chapters would give me feel like 2.5 years to make a single chapter of manga in my part four that's absolutely ridiculous amount of time and of course we can forget about uh, another map part for looney because looney is approaching 1 million subscribers so 
Of course I will have to outdo myself on that. Now I'm kidding, I won't be outdoing myself this much. So that was it for goal number one, map arts. Okay, goal number two, one million of every item, block, whatever, tool, everything. One million of every. One million of netherite host? Yes, it has to be stored somewhere. One million of sand? Yes, one million of deep. One million of everything. That goal, as I already discussed on this live stream, is kind of ridiculous because this way i need 13 million diamonds to get 1 million jute boxes 1 million enchanting tables 1 million diamond blocks and 1 million diamonds and 1 million of every single tool i can get from trading yeah, so basically there are things that only can be get from trading at least only can be get from trading in this amount so my statistic for trading is supposed to be like in the billions or even maxed out Oh my god, I actually have six goals. So one million of every single item, block, tool, whatever. Enchanted book, one million of everything. That can be obtained in survival item form. I want to obtain it. Pretty self-explanatory. Just a friendly reminder. Over 95% of my viewers are not subscribed. So if you don't want to miss any of my future amazing videos, subscribe. And don't forget to turn on all notifications because... If you don't do that, YouTube won't notify you about my future uploads. Move on with the video. Okay, so it's time to jump to goal number three. And it is actually my first uh, like real video on this channel. Max stats. What is What are max stats? Objectives at display, sidebar, custom, aviate. As you can see, I have aviate distance in negative 700 million. Why? Because I surpassed the limit of 2,147,483,647 on the statistics here distance by elytra over i have flight over that should be like about 35 million blocks with elytra am i right on the topic okay cool uh okay so maxing out stats i want to max as many stats as possible i know for a fact that in my lifetime i won't be able to max out every single stat of course because there are stats like using a sword you can use sword every every other second or, uh, or every half a second that is like 30 years to get 2.1 billion like ask someone what they did 1 billion times what the answer what is the answer to what you did 1 billion times <clears throat> okay so what did you do 1 billion times in your life have you ever done some 1 billion times. I want you to think about it. So, okay. Humans blink 15 to 20 times a minute. Let's just assume we are blinking 20 times a minute. So we have 20 times a minute. We blink 1,200 times per hour, 28,000 times per day, 10 million times per year. You would have to live 100 years to blink 1 billion times. And to max out a stat, you have to do it 2.1 billion times, not 1 billion. To blink 2.1 billion times, you would have to live 210 years. You haven't blinked 1 billion times in life. And this is something we do constantly. Where it comes to it, you want even people who eat like 10,000 calories per day haven't eaten 1 billion calories in their life. There's simply not that many things that are like in the realms of everyday life that human can do 1 billion times. You have games when, where you can like have cookie clickers or something when you get 1 billion of something or for example for me it's Minecraft when I get like 1 mil when I get like 3 billion centimeters with Elytra or 2 billion click or node block or 2 billion clicks on a bell but I am clicking faster than I could ever proceed so uh, there's simply nothing like the realm of everyday life that you do 1 billion times in your life yeah of course you could say Oh, I interacted with over 1 billion atoms. Yeah, my first proper video on this channel was about maxing out statistics and how it's possible to do it in survival and what statistics you can max out. I will definitely make an update video to that because that video is old. And since then we had two new updates. I gained a ton of new knowledge about mechanics, about uh, what's possible with Tweakeroo. I have a way better mic uh, a way better 
approach to making videos and my editor also gained quite a lot of skill so maxing out the statistic it shows how many dislikes the video have to be honest, the easiest statistics to max out are distance statistics you can max them out easily because you can like hack some statistics for example you can hack any mount statistic can be gained as fast as you can gain a minecart statistic because you can put a mount in a minecart and move it around like a minecart this way i managed to get my distance by force 214 km maxing out statistics you can actually mine more than one block per tick but reliably while afking you can mine 72,000 blocks per hour to max out pickaxe uses i would have to afk in a 72,000 block per hour farm for 3.4 years unless i found find a way to mine something faster than 72,000 blocks per hour reliably for a long period of time yeah I, I actually think i found something like that yeah i found something like that it is a really really ridiculous idea of mine i actually have found out a way to mine something faster than 72,000 per hour and it's mining snow yeah snow is one of the things it would only take me one year to max out a shovel statistic sort of snow farm but you have a problem with showers that, uh, first of all, I would have to get this many shovels or constantly repair them. Repairing another right shovel, that might be difficult. So actually I will make snow farm for this purpose uh, right here in the gold farm. That is like going to trash pretty much all the snow. Because I know I am myself, but I don't need how many shovel types are there. Uh, wooden stone iron gold netherite and diamond sorry but i don't need 12 billion snowballs i know i am myself i know i need quite a ridiculous amount of stuff but i don't need 12 billion snowballs yeah actually using uh, 2.1 billion snowballs is on my list of things to do i will use 2.1 billion snowballs that's going to happen okay so there are actually a lot of plans where it comes to maxing out statistics because look at that these are general statistics. There's a lot of them. A lot of them can be maxed out. Especially distance. Just look at the distance. Um, you have distance. Distance climbed. Distance crouched. Distance fallen. Distance flown. Distance, distance swam. Distance walked. Distance walked on water. Distance walked underwater. Distance by boat. Distance by a light run. Distance by horse. Distance Minecraft, distance by peak, distance by strider, all those distances can be easily maxed out. Think easily. They are the easiest type of statistic. And then you have times mine pretty hard to max out. Going to outright state that it's pretty hard to max this statistic. Times broke. Going to be pretty hard to max out. Not gonna possibly no 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 not with really. i would have to craft 2.1 billion iron shovel uh, that's not going to how oh, i i don't know what could i even need a uh, break there's uh, like absolutely no two all that broken to i'm scrafted easy i'm going to do that for sure i have one million hundred six thousand bone meal craft yeah i'm going to craft 2.1 billion bone meal. and even then you can infinite craft things like bone meal, for example you can infinite craft those because you can craft bone meal Craft it up, bone blocks, and crap bone meal again. Same goes for gold ingots, gold blocks, gold nuggets, redstone dust, redstone blocks. Everything that can be crafted and recrafted again is in recraftable. And you can craft faster than a uh, human can perceive. So that except my item scroller is a little bit off, which I can't really craft that fast or whatever it is. Times used. 1.6 billion worth from I'm working on the statistic, it's going to be a huge part of my updated statistic. I'm not doing the updated statistic video right now. Stop going in depth in the statistic. But you can use a lot of things to the max without too much effort. Just because you have fast ride speed. And it's absolutely the best of uh, Twicker. Okay, then you have mobs. And mobs are a little bit more complicated. You're definitely not going to get killed by something 2.1 billion times. Maybe by a player because you can kill yourself. No, still no then. You could possibly like kill players, but it would require like a lot of alt accounts or a lot of uh, a lot of alt accounts or a lot of comments spamming. You would have to make it to spam a comment for spawning in players. Uh, I am at 12.7 zombified pigs. 
12 points. Yeah, I am all on my way to maxing this, but not with this farm. It's not going. I will have to update this so many times to get to the 2.1 billion mark. Okay, pops are pretty much not something you when maxing up. As I said, I was going through COVID. Okay, calm down. I always get so hyped when I'm talking about statistics. Because goddamn, this topic started my channel and I love it. That's it for today's episode. If you like, if you enjoy, subscribe if you haven't. Don't forget to turn on all the notifications to never miss any of the future uploads. Because there is a ton of future content coming. I am uploading twice a day. So you definitely have to turn on that notification bell. Also follow me on all the social media. And visit my TikTok. Because I am pretty proud of it right now. If you want to know me better, then you should definitely do that. That's it. Take care. See you next time.